Good morning guys, welcome to today. It is Wednesday, it feels like a trailer, hashtag trailer life. I can tell the days of the week apart. Anyway, we're headed home today, the girls and I. We woke up, we had a leisurely breakfast of toast and bacon and eggs. And now we're headed home to do all of our laundry because we have a crazy busy weekend ahead of us and we need clean clothes. just getting laundry done um, but while we are doing chores at home I'm gonna show you my writing lesson this week it was crazy I think I'm gonna try and narrate along with you and explain everything that happened because there's a little bit of screaming in this video and there's a reason why I'm gonna explain what happened but basically the horse I rode um, did the lesson without me. He knew where we were going, what we were doing. He knows all the words that Fiona said. She said canter, he cantered. She said stop, change direction, he changed direction. It was insane. And uh, the best part about the whole ride for me was um, that even when I had to cool him out, he cooled himself out. He just walked in his own little path and did everything himself. All my muscles are aching today. Like, I was holding on with my neck, I was holding on with my back, I was holding on with my ankles. Like, I was holding on, you guys. Anyway, you guys can watch that footage now. All right, you guys getting the horses ready? Did you need help? Sir. It's hard to get used to a new horse. That's why everybody should ride lots of horses, because it makes it hard to ride a new horse when you're not used to it. Storm, I'm not riding you. He's like, get away. <laughs> First day of spring, and I just want to sing. To everything that's moving, every single little thing To them birds flying free Oh, God. This is not convertible. <laughs> 
sure that I'm sure that once you, go. once you guys get that bond. Yeah. It's really fast. And at least you have all of those color shadow packs. Go big with her, huh? Did you get that part on camera? Yeah. Yeah? Did she stop doing it? Like when she asked you to jog, jog, and then you stopped, like then you cantered, and then when you were done cantering, it died. Oh. Well, so I don't. So at the last part, before like the. I do not know nice what. nice trot, then you're done. Oh, I do not know what jog means. Jog? I need to speak English. I only can speak English, even though I ride in a Western, Western saddle. Trot. Yeah, he looks so pretty. Are you going um, for a trail ride on him? With just that saddle? Pad. Pad? This is like, oh. I'm I have to use it. Right. Carry around a tooth. And while I was riding, Sophie decided to pull out a tooth. In there. Cool. Let's see which I one get, is it. I get money. Yep, you get money. Is that two teeth out in that same spot? Why is it two scarred them? Clearly, Blue and I are not a match made in heaven, uh, but Sabrina and she I. She said jog and you can't. She said jog and I can't I don't know what jog means. I'm saying, ooh, ah. I've legit never seen a baby bird as cute as that. Look at how cuddled up he is, you guys. Ugh. Try not to touch him or pay much attention to him so that he has a better chance. Look at him, so cute. There's a lot more to keeping baby birds alive than you would think. First of all, they have to be kept warm. If they get cold and chilled, that's it, they're gone. But anyway, he's so cute. I love them at this age. Uh -oh. <laughs> I love them at this age. Because they're so cute. Now he's gonna poop. He's gonna climb out of his bed. Ah! Not on me! Oh, darn it. You missed. That was not cool, dude. Alright, I've been cleaning the house, doing the lawn, cleaning up the yard, doing so much laundry. It took Nick to get a haircut, and, the, um, and I've been editing. It's been a wasted, amazing, beautiful summer day with us stuck at home doing doing stuff that we don't just doing chores so we are headed now to do something so fun and so exciting that I cannot wait to share with you guys if Sam just said it's not that exciting it is so exciting to me exciting for me it's like what it's all about for me oh aren't you the cutest little puppy so cute Right. Oh, and you too. <laughs> and that's what we're here to see. That's the trailer. And that's the trailer. I know. Wow. I wish we were coming here for that. I know. That's you. <laughs> like, come on. That's like, oh. That is. Is it pregnant? He's cute. Is, is she pregnant? Uh, who? The horsey? Uh, no. She's cute. She's just very fat. Right, so this is the so trailer. As far as I know, it's to the kids playing hoops, going loop de loop, the rainbow colored bouncy ball. Up here is where you put all your yeah, stuff. Yeah, storage, yeah. And their ice cream scoops Got my shoes in my hand So you don't want too much room or they'll be like flying all over Oh yeah, that's a good point. What, how come so there's like a bumper right there? Yeah, so yeah. maybe you want extra bumpers. Yeah. 
I like it though. I like it because it's super wide. Like it's a three plus two plus one, right? Yeah, it needs a little bit of work. But the floors are good. Look over there. Pull that carpet up. Oh, yeah, it's good. What do you think, Abby? What do you think, Sophie? You guys ready for a horse trailer? I don't know. I like it. But the problem is, it's going to be way too big. Because the truck is way too big. Yeah, we're not going to have him to tow it. Dad's going to have to do that. I don't know. I like it. Do you like it? Is that thing broken over there? That white thing? Is it necessary? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. But you can get new ones those. Okay. I don't know. I think. See? Mom. Mom. I like your idea of letting the pony run around. Because I want a miniature pony, a baby though, and let it run around. Yeah, I like a free range pony myself. Um, so, this is where we put all of our saddles and stuff, I guess. We need to get it painted. Obviously, two horses back there. And then if you have a third, you get a tie and you put it here and then you have another spot. But she said that when she was at shows, like because there's two doors, that one and that one across from each other. They set their, whoops, they set their lawn chairs in here and there's like a breeze blowing from through and nice and shady and stuff. It doesn't smell. Okay, we'll see. Sweet. We could be horses together, right? Uh, I think we're taking this thing home with us, but um, not today yeah, because we still need to get to a uh, hitch, wait, which is happening on Friday. The barn. Bye. All right, bye guys. We're gonna see you at the bar. Yeah. Anyway, while we wait for Sam to figure out what he's doing, um, okay, so this okay. happened. So we decided, we talked about it with our instructor. We decided to let um, another um, more advanced rider at our barn ride Storm on occasion to really push him and um, get him going because Gabby's having trouble getting him over the jumps and stuff because of her own fear and we don't want to train him, we don't want to teach him to be afraid. So we decided to do that. Anyway, she rode him for the first time today and we just got pictures and a video and um, our instructor's like, wow, your horse can jump. That's our horse. That's not Gabby on there, but that's our horse. That's your horse, Gabby. Gabby's not super in love with the fact that somebody else is running him, but he needs to be worked. So sometimes you just have to take one for the team and do what's best for your horse.